Yeah, obviously this is a tough loss. We we're playing an excellent team, and uh, you know we uh, I thought we competed on the defensive end, but uh, you know we didn't execute offensively at a high enough level to uh, win, and we didn't shoot it well enough. Um, shots. Uh, you know, we're hard to come by in this game. They are a really good defensive team, but when we had our opportunities, we didn't shoot it very well. Um, you know, and then, uh, you know, number 20 for them, Kuzmanic had just an outstanding game, and, uh, you know, she made some tough shots, and, and she stayed active and beat us on cuts. She just, she was excellent tonight. You, you played a lot, to, well, your girls played a lot better in the fourth quarter. What, what do you think the difference was there, Carl? Uh, probably a sense of urgency. Mm -hmm. I mean, the the biggest uh, stretch in the game that hurt us was the very beginning of the third quarter. Yeah. Like, we did a pretty good, they're a great three-point shooting team, and we only gave up three threes, but two of them were in the first minute and a half or so of the second half, and uh, off just mistakes. So all of a sudden, I think they're 8-0 right out of, you know, you'll have to check it. But That's correct. They were like 8-0 right to start the second half. And you dig, you know, we were able to fight <coughs> back and, and tie it and get back into it. But uh, ultimately, they made the last <coughs> positive play, and they deserve to win. Uh, the last play with Lisa. Looked like you got maybe what you were looking for. I thought it was going down, kid. Yeah, that's a shot she uh, normally makes. That one looked good. I mean, it hit every part of the rim and rolled out. It's just, you know, that's just uh, how it how it falls out sometimes. But uh, I thought she got a really good shot on a shot that she takes a lot and finishes a lot. So we were happy with the shot we got at the end of the game. But uh, you know, we're I guess we're maybe more disappointed that uh, you know the shot that we gave up. You know, it's a little too close to the basket to their best player. Uh, you know, that's something that we'll have to work on. Lisa, did did you think you had it? Did you think it was going down the last shot there? Yeah, I mean, that's a shot I take a lot, and normally I make it a lot of times. So I was hoping it would go in, but <laughs> yeah. they they were very good defensively, <laughs> weren't they, Lisa? What was it like playing against them? It seemed like they had you guarded on the arc really well, and they also were cut off the lanes pretty well, I thought. Yeah, I think it was definitely um, difficult for us to get open threes, which normally we, that's like um, a big part of our game. So we had to like try to stretch them out and like get to the rim more. And um, yeah, I think they did a pretty good job of guarding us. Naz, you really gave them a huge lift there. Uh, you scored like 12 points in about four minutes at one point. Uh, did, you know, Carl said, you know, maybe you played a little bit better, not you necessarily, but everybody played a little bit better toward the end because there's a sense of urgency. Were you kind of feeling at that point that, you know, somebody's got to step up and do something here and it should be me, I guess? Or were you just getting open for, you know? Um, I think that um, I was, I mean, I feel like I was being a little more aggressive, but I feel like I was taking shots I would normally take in, in any other game. But it was like, I did have a sense of urgency just because we were down and we needed to score. Anything else? Uh, let, let me fire in some Duke questions real quick. If you don't okay. I won't keep you but just a minute, but uh, I'm going to be off for the next week or whatever. Uh, your, your thoughts on Duke? I, I know you were looking really hard at this game because UAB was a heck of a foe, but have you looked at Duke much this season? Uh, I haven't. I haven't looked at Duke at all yet. That'll be something that uh, I'll start on tomorrow. I'll watch this game tonight, take some notes, and then I'll start breaking down <coughs> Duke tomorrow. and. Uh, <coughs> I just hope that when we come back, we have kind of a renewed energy for the second part of the season and uh, that we take the time that we have before conference and make the absolute most of it by improving every day. Uh, you know, one thing, I know they have a lot of returning players at UAB, but I, I really did think they worked as a team better than we did uh, from the communication standpoint to uh, moving together and moving the ball. Uh, so hopefully we can learn something from what UAB was doing to us and start to become better at it ourselves. Okay, I'll bother you later on next week <laughs> on the phone. Yeah. But Lisa Z, uh, Duke, just your thoughts. I'm sure you probably haven't broken them down or anything yet, but pretty cool that y'all are going to Duke, eh? Yeah, that's a pretty big opportunity. 
and we're just trying to make the most out of it and hopefully get a good game in before conference starts. And, and Naz, you guys look forward to playing on the floors of teams like this, don't you? Oh, yeah. <laughs> I guess, yeah. I haven't even thought about that, but yeah. I, I, I understand, so. yeah. yeah. <laughs> well, it'd be a nice bounce back for you after this, after you take yeah. a little break here, go to Duke, maybe you could pick up a win at Duke. That'd be a big deal for you girls, wouldn't it? Yeah, that'd be nice. <laughs> All right. Okay. Thanks, guys. Thanks, guys. Thanks. Thank you.